In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to create a new worksheet template. Go to Data, select Add Remove Traces, Traces window will pop up. Drop down through the list to choose your preferred traces by checking the corresponding boxes. If you want to create new traces which are not already existing in the traces list, click on New. New trace window will pop up. Select the main type. For example, I will add a trace for EEG with double reference to reduce the EKG artifacts if present. Drop down through the main type and select the EEG type. From the drop down lists, select the required exploring signal. Select reference 1 and reference 2. Click OK and click OK. If you want to change the sequence of the traces, just drag and drop. If you want to change the color of the trace, Activate the trace by left clicking on it. It will be highlighted in blue. Right click on the activated trace, select Properties, Trace Properties window will pop up. Go to the tab View. On the right upper corner, click on Color and select your preferred color. Click OK. Go to the tab Filters. Type the required values in order to change the filter settings if needed. Click OK. In RimLogic, it is possible to organize your traces based on the main type of your signals by the grouping option. This will help also in scaling all signals from all main types together instead of doing that at trace by trace. To do that, right click and from the options window, select Group. And if you want to scale up these signals, right click on the options window and select scale up. All signals will be scaled together. If you want to identify the amplitudes for the EEG signals, so it will be easy to identify delta activity. To do that, press right click. Click on Ungroup, activate a trace from the EEG, then click on the amplitude axis, which is located on the left side of the pane. Click on Properties, Amplitude Axis Properties window will pop up. On the tab Categories, check the box to display categories. Click on Insert to insert the values.
click OK. And click OK. To invert the polarity, right click on the trace and click on Invert. Once you finish your required changes, and in order to save this under New Worksheet Template, right click on the Worksheet Templates pane. Select Save as Worksheet Template. New Template Wizard window will pop up. Read and follow the instructions. Then click Next. If you want this template to be accessible for each PC in the sleep lab, then you select the working group template. If you don't have intro network, then you select local template. Click next. Give a name for your new template. Add description to differentiate from other templates. Click Next. And click Finish. Left click on your current sheet template and go to insert. Then browse for your new template. Creating a new sheet template is finalized. 